11 Warning Signs of Vitamin D Deficiency Vitamin D, also known as the sunshine vitamin, is essential to the upkeep of multiple aspects of our health. It is synthesized from cholesterol in our bodies when our skin is subjected to UV rays from the sun. This nutrient component is absolutely necessary for maintaining a healthy life, particularly with regard to bone health and the immune system. However, the level of vitamin D in our bodies decreases, which results in a wide range of health problems, until the deficiency has already caused some degree of harm to their bodies. Most people don't even notice that. In the United States, vitamin D deficiency affects nearly 42% of the population. In today's video, together we will explore 11 warning signs of vitamin D deficiency to protect our health from any unforeseen danger. Now, let's begin with the video. 1. Fatigue and tiredness Is the persistent feeling of tiredness not going away? Are you getting enough sleep and still waking up with an urge to get more sleep? If this is your story, then it is time to find some answers in your diet. This consistent fatigue and endless tiredness is probably because you have a vitamin D deficiency. One primary factor is its role in calcium and phosphorus balance, which are vital for energy metabolism. Vitamin D aids in the absorption of calcium and phosphorus from the gut. When deficient, this process is impaired, leading to decreased muscle function and energy levels. Another aspect is vitamin D's influence on sleep. Studies suggest that low levels of vitamin D may disrupt sleep patterns, contributing to poor sleep quality and duration, which in turn may lead to fatigue. Vitamin D also plays a role in mitochondrial function. Mitochondria are the powerhouses of cells, generating energy. A deficiency in vitamin D may impair mitochondrial function, leading to decreased energy production and increased fatigue Maintaining a balanced diet and getting engaged in regular exercise will boost your stamina and help you fight fatigue. 2. Weakness in bones Another common sign that you may not be receiving adequate vitamin D is experiencing pain and weakness in your bones. You may already be aware that vitamin D is crucial for calcium absorption in the intestines. When there's a deficiency, calcium absorption is impaired, leading to lower levels of calcium in the blood. This condition, known as hypocalcemia, may cause loss of the bones, leading to bone pain. Vitamin D plays its fair share in the process of bone mineralization, where minerals like calcium and phosphorus are deposited in the bones, strengthening them. A deficiency in vitamin D leads to demineralization making bones weaker and more likely to break easily. In adults, vitamin D deficiency may result in osteomalacia, a condition where bones become soft due to poor mineralization. This softening of the bones may cause significant bone pain and tenderness. According to the findings of a meta-analysis of 81 separate studies, patients who suffered from arthritis, muscle pain, or chronic widespread pain tended to have lower levels of vitamin D than those who did not have these conditions. Moreover, low levels of calcium due to poor vitamin D induced absorption may lead to secondary hyperparathyroidism. This condition involves the parathyroid glands secreting excess parathyroid hormone, PTH, to maintain calcium levels. Excess PTH may lead to bone resorption, further weakening bones, which disrupts your normal life. 3. Digestive Issues The impact of vitamin D extends beyond its role in maintaining bone health. You will be amazed to know that vitamin D plays a role in the health of the gut and the regulation of processes like inflammation. That's why a deficiency might contribute to various digestive problems, potentially exacerbating conditions like inflammatory bowel disease, IBD, Crohn's disease, and irritable bowel syndrome, IBS. 4. 
muscle weakness. Poor muscle health frequently makes our dream of leading a fit life more difficult. When you don't find enough strength in your arms and legs muscles, a deficiency of vitamin D is probably the reason. You must know that muscle cells require calcium for contraction. When vitamin D is deficient, the essential calcium absorption is reduced, leading to decreased calcium availability for muscle function, resulting in muscle weakness. Aside from that, vitamin D receptors are present in muscle tissue. These receptors are involved in protein synthesis within muscle cells. A deficiency in vitamin D may impair this process, leading to decreased muscle mass and strength. Thus, you may experience inefficient muscle function. Vitamin D is important for neuromuscular functioning. It aids in the transmission of nerve impulses to muscle fibers, which is a must to manage and monitor muscle functions. A deficiency may disrupt these signals, causing muscle weakness. To deal with this problem, you should focus on having a calcium and sodium balanced diet to properly maintain the electrical waves in your brain, which may be a great help in muscle function. 5. Mood Changes What else may go wrong when you have a low vitamin D level? Well, the story doesn't end here. Vitamin D plays a role in the synthesis of serotonin, a neurotransmitter that is key to mood regulation. Low levels of vitamin D may lead to decreased serotonin production, which is linked to mood disorders such as depression. Vitamin D receptors are present in many areas of the brain involved in mood regulation. These receptors influence brain function and neuroplasticity, the brain's ability to adapt and reorganize. It means that a deficiency in vitamin D may impair these processes, potentially leading to mood imbalances. In addition, vitamin D may influence the functioning of a number of different hormonal pathways in the body. These hormones, especially the female hormones, are extremely overpowering in mental health regulation. Whenever there is an imbalance in these hormonal pathways, mood may be affected. 6. Impaired Wound Healing Vitamin D is an extremely essential nutrient in the human body. It plays a crucial role in the functioning of various cells involved in the wound healing process, including keratinocytes and macrophages. These cells help in the formation of new tissue and in fighting infection. Thus, a deficiency in vitamin D may impair their function, leading to slower wound closure and an increased risk of infection. Also, vitamin D is important in regulating the body's inflammatory response, which is a critical part of the wound healing process. Proper inflammation helps to clear debris and pathogens from the wound site. When there is vitamin D deficiency in the body, it may lead to an imbalanced inflammatory response, either insufficient or prolonged, both of which may impair healing. Are you aware of the fact that vitamin D also promotes angiogenesis? This is the process where new blood vessels form to support the supply chain of nutrients and oxygen throughout the body. Its deficiency may lead to the reduced formation of new blood vessels, slowing down the healing process. Collagen is an essential component of skin and new tissue formation, and the synthesis of collagen requires vitamin D. Vitamin D is also involved in the process. The newly formed tissue strength and integrity may be negatively impacted when levels are insufficient, which may lead to collagen production of a lower quality or none at all. 7. High Blood Pressure There is evidence to suggest that vitamin D plays a role in cardiovascular health including blood pressure regulation. This vitamin is known to suppress the renin-angiotensin system, RAS, which plays a crucial role in blood pressure regulation. The RAS controls blood vessel constriction, sodium, and water retention, both of which are key factors in blood pressure regulation. Overactivity of renin-angiotensin system 
may lead to hypertension. Vitamin D, by inhibiting RAS, may help lower blood pressure. In addition to that, vitamin D is believed to improve the functioning of endothelial cells, which line the blood vessels. Since these cells play a key role in maintaining vascular health and regulating blood pressure, vitamin D might reduce the risk of hypertension. 8. Hair Loss A lack of vitamin D not only makes you fragile on the inside, but it also causes damage to your skin and other external components. This essential vitamin contributes to the formation of new hair follicles, which are the minute pores from which new hairs emerge. It is possible that a lack of vitamin D will lead to a reduction in the number of new hair follicles being created, which in turn may cause thinning and loss of hair. Do you know that there are three phases that make up the hair growth cycle? The phase in which our hair grows quickly is called the anagen phase. Then our hair experiences gradual change, which is called the catagen phase, and the phase in which our hair enters a state of dormancy is called the telogen phase. Premature hair loss is a result of hairs entering their resting phase before they should. Moreover, vitamin D may have an effect on the production of keratin, which is a protein that plays an important role in maintaining the health of hair and contributing to its strength. A deficiency in vitamin D could compromise the integrity of the hair and possibly cause hair loss. 9. Reduced immune system function It might not come as a shock if we tell you that most people who suffered badly from COVID were deficient in vitamin D, according to various studies. One of the reasons behind it is probably this vitamin's role in regulating T cells. These cells are essential for the immune response and to strengthen the barrier between us and infections due to viruses and bacteria. It is possible that your T cells will not be able to respond and effectively fight off serious infections if you do not get enough vitamin D. Apart from that, vitamin D has been shown to have anti-inflammatory effects. If you do not have enough of something, it could throw off the balance between pro-inflammatory and anti-inflammatory responses, leading to too many inflammatory responses. This may weaken the immune system and make it more likely that infections will develop. When vitamin D is present in the body, there is an increase in the production of antimicrobial peptides which is beneficial to both immune cells and epithelial cells. These peptides are an essential component of the body's innate immune response and play a critical role in protecting the body from harmful pathogens such as bacteria, viruses and fungi. Thus, you should always focus on maintaining a proper balance of vitamin D for better health. 10. Chronic Back Pain Earlier in this video, we mentioned that vitamin D is essential for the absorption and metabolism of calcium and phosphorus to maintain strong and healthy bones. Deficiency in vitamin D may lead to conditions like osteoporosis, bone weakening and osteomalacia, bone softening, both of which may cause back pain. Weak or brittle bones are more susceptible to fractures and deformities which may contribute to chronic pain in the spine and back area. Studies have been conducted to explore these relationships. For example, a study with 98 patients from the age group of 18 to 70 years indicates that maintaining adequate levels of vitamin D is important for spinal health and may help in managing or preventing chronic back pain. In addition to that, vitamin D receptors are present in muscle tissue and adequate levels of the vitamin are necessary for optimal muscle strength and function. Deficiency may result in muscle weakness, which may compromise the support that muscles provide to the spine, leading to poor posture and increased strain on the back, thereby causing pain. There is some evidence to suggest that vitamin D may influence neuromuscular function and pain sensation. Deficiency could potentially affect nerve function and pain perception related to back pain. 
11. Cognitive impairments. Last but not least, a low level of vitamin D may also affect your brain. Since vitamin D receptors are present in the brain, this vitamin plays a role in cognitive functions such as protecting your memory. Decreased levels of vitamin D have been associated with a higher risk of cognitive impairments including dementia and Alzheimer's disease. They could involve the role that vitamin D plays in the growth of nerves, inflammation, or blood flow to the brain. How may we restore vitamin D balance in our body? Restoring the balance of vitamins in the body involves a combination of lifestyle changes, dietary adjustments, and possibly supplementation. Although you should remember that restoring and maintaining vitamin D balance is a gradual process it's essential to consult with healthcare professionals to tailor the approach to your individual health, needs and circumstances. Let's learn how you can boost your vitamin D level. 1. Sunlight Exposure Sunlight is the most natural way to get vitamin D. When the skin is exposed to UVB rays from the sun, it synthesizes vitamin D. Aim for about 10 to 30 minutes of midday sun exposure several times a week, depending on your skin type, location, and the season. However, it's important to balance sun exposure with skin cancer risk, so don't overdo it and use sunscreen as needed. 2. Dietary Sources If your daily routine doesn't allow you enough time and opportunity to soak in the sun, you may get adequate nutrients from diets. Include more vitamin D rich foods in your menu. Some of the best sources are fatty fish like salmon, mackerel, and sardines. Egg yolks, especially from free range chickens. Mushrooms exposed to sunlight. Fortified foods such as certain cereals, dairy products, and orange juice. 3. Regular testing. As we age, our vitamin and hormonal balances often get disturbed. This may not show any early symptoms, but it will weaken your body in the near future. That's why regular blood tests may help monitor your vitamin D levels, particularly if you're at risk of deficiency due to factors like living in a location with limited sun exposure, having darker skin, being older, or having certain medical conditions. 4. Lifestyle Factors Various aspects of a person's lifestyle may have an impact on their vitamin D levels. Regular physical activity and maintaining a healthy body weight may support both the synthesis and utilization of vitamin D in the body. 5. Consider seasonal changes. During the winter months, the sun's rays in many areas are not strong enough to cause the body to produce sufficient amounts of vitamin D during these times, you should place a greater emphasis on the sources that come from your diet and consider taking supplements. However, you should always consult a healthcare professional before taking any supplements. Recognizing these 11 signs of vitamin D deficiency is vital for maintaining overall health. Incorporating vitamin D rich foods, responsible sun exposure and supplements, if necessary, may greatly mitigate these risks. Regular checkups and blood tests may also help in early detection and management. Remember, a balanced diet and lifestyle are key to preventing vitamin D deficiency and maintaining optimal health. Always consult a medical professional or a dietitian before making any significant dietary changes in your life. We have discussed many signs of vitamin D deficiency which may potentially harm our physical health, but as we know, our daily diets play a crucial role in maintaining our overall health. If you are looking for more food-related videos, here's one we recommend you check out. Watch 11 Powerful Brain Foods That Can Help Fight Dementia Or watch Eat Oats Every Day For One Week See What Happens To Your Body Are you experiencing any of the signs mentioned in this video? currently? Let us know in the comments section.